All right, let's talk a little bit about uh, the charts here. Three charts I want to bring up today. Uh, first one is oil. We're looking at oil here. This is a 10 minute chart. And you can see again, overnight oil rallied to that 106 level. We got up to 105.91 at around 6 a.m. here on the West Coast uh, before the regular markets opened. So European markets took us up. But what's important to note here is if you're a U.S. market hour trader, we had a breakdown here at the open. Uh, the market opened at 6.30, uh, at least the equities, uh, and oil traded down here to 104.86. I drew a fib line and we were looking for this 105.40 area. You can see right in here the red line was 105.50. Front run it a little bit and we offered out there at 105.40 and the short trade on oil has worked very nicely. Again, nice trend in line here all day on, on the um, oil and you had one touch here at 105 that was worth selling again that came off almost another full dollar so this is a very good depiction of a chart that looks uh, very nice to the downside trending and this is what we're trying to do is just take again the meat out of that middle that was a very nice trade for us uh, next trade uh, next chart I want to throw up underneath here is wheat and same thing we were looking for we always look for this uh, breakdown this first five minute bar here was at 782 and when we broke that you just put a stop sell stop in usually on these grains above or below say two cents and if these things break down break up they usually move that whole day wheat broke down 780 all the way down to 750 now is bouncing but the trade the meat of the trade here was basically from 780 to 750 it was a very nice setup very nice trade easy to trade very you know very again trend trading wait for a breakdown breakdown to show you this is what we uh, plan for every day and that worked out nicely now I want to bring up a chart of the ES that is a perfect depiction of a whipsaw day and uh, we do have expiration on the futures beginning tomorrow we roll over next Friday complete but everybody starts trading really Friday this week uh, the June contract so beware of uh, the rollover time. Here's what we saw. We wait for that first half hour today and we, we, we had actually broken out. After that first half hour our high was about 13, 19 and a half. We said buy a little bit over 21 and a half. Guess what folks? We went over that. We reversed hard. I mean this was a very hard reversal. I also added some down to 13, 17 which was the, the retracement of that first move so I was looking to add there. I sure didn't think we were going to see this candle here. There wasn't any news. I think there's just a lot of movement going on. Now, my stop was at 1311, which was two points below the day's close. I, however, moved it. When we started moving up here, I didn't think we'd get past this 1317 level because the context changed. I just want to talk about these markets again. 